Today I'm going to Susikino with my friend. We're gonna meet up at McDonald's. I feel like in my vlogs it makes it seem like I go to McDonald's a lot because in like half of my vlogs I do go to McDonald's. But it's really just because I go to McDonald's when I'm out because I can actually eat the food. I I don't eat McDonald's that often. So we're planning on hopefully finding shoes for me because my shoes are like a size 26 or like nine and a half in American sizes. And in Japan, generally speaking, women's shoes do not come in that size. Except for Shimamura, which is where I got these clothes because they have like a lot of like bigger sizes. And they say they have the size for my shoes but they don't actually keep them in store at all or online. So I don't really understand what's going on, but we're gonna see if we can find some slip on shoes for me because I don't really have any. Um, and yeah, just have fun, go shopping, I guess. <laughs> Let's go. Also, I added a necklace. <laughs> I forgot to put on jewelry before I said hi. Um, so I put on my little, Gigi from Kiki's Delivery Service necklace and some earrings, which you can't really see. Um, also, it's totally a rainy day, but I just kind of said fuck it and didn't bring an umbrella. is what I came here to get. They're so expensive. They have a gacha of a gacha that is so cute. We're waiting for our drinks now. We stopped at a cafe and it's so, so cute. I want to go to the second floor, but you need to order like like a dessert or something and I got ice cream but I guess that doesn't count <laughs> so first floor it is
This is really good. We went to a cafe and it was like a matcha cafe and there's like, I got matcha tapioca and matcha milk ice cream and I took out my hair as you can tell I have the braids and I took them out because it's like so so humid right now that like when I when I was in one of the recycle shops I looked in the mirror and I saw just like hair sticking out everywhere and I was like oh my god I look crazy so I had to take them out just like us walking around just going like <laughs> so we went to donkey I got a bunch of stuff I'll make a little haul when I get home where else do we go Second Street, the recycle shop. Mm -hmm. Another recycle shop. We go to the recycle shop. Some other places. Oh, we went to like a shoe store for a little bit. We've done a lot of walking. I think we, we started at Tanaki Koji number one, the first set of first street. And now we're on like number five or six or something. Okay, so we're all done we're having our break and snack and stuff and we're gonna head to a department store to see if we can find shoes in my size because I'm a size 26, like 26 centimeters in Japan, which is like two sizes bigger than what you, the usual like maximum size is at stores. So we're hoping we can find some shoes for me. That's cool. Lawson because we don't really have any food at home right now so I wanted to grab just some small things to eat for dinner um, and I realized it's kind of raining and I didn't bring my umbrella with me so I asked Guilherme to come meet me he did pick me up <laughs> okay so I just got back home and I'm sitting on my floor because I am okay <laughs> um, I never found any shoes that fit me we went to a few department stores. They were more like malls. They weren't really like department stores, but whatever, I guess. So anyway, on to the next thing. I'm gonna show you what I bought today. So from Daiso, I got this Cinemoral coin pouch. I've already started using it uh, because the coin 
pouch in my wallet broke because <laughs> you have so many coins in Japan that they don't really like fit into small coin pouches. I got some masking tape. I got these stickers and I got this notebook and I was kind of planning on using the stickers and the masking tape for this notebook, which I think I'm going to write like kind of like a daily diary in Chinese so I can keep practicing my Chinese because here I don't have that many opportunities to like speak it and kind of keep up my level. And I also got a measuring tape because I didn't have one and I wanted one. After that, as we saw, I won this Miffy cup and a claw machine. It's the first time I've ever won a claw machine in my entire life. I just think maybe it's like, I'm just kind of dumb, I don't know. But I was so excited and this is pretty cute. I wanted to try the kind where you like pull at this loop because I think it's a bit easier and a bit safer than going for like the classic claw machine. Because the classic one, you can kind of like pick it up and then it drops it and bounces in a completely bad place. But usually no matter what you do with this, you just get closer and closer to dropping it in. I think I ended up spending around maybe a little less than 2,000 yen trying to get this, which isn't that bad. It's about maybe 15 to 18 dollars. It's a little expensive, but for the joy of playing claw machine and getting my first claw machine ever, I'm okay with that, you know? After that, we went to Don Quixote. I pretty much just got food. I got this ring light as well, which I can't unbox for you because I'm already using it right now. For food, I got these um, milk teas that I really like. They're like premium craft boss milk teas, but they're only 78 yen, which is like, I don't know, like 50 cents a bottle. And so I was like, oh, hell yeah. And these are kind of hard to find. Like you can only, from my experience, I can only find them in like grocery stores and not like convenience stores. So I thought, why not? I also got this Kero Kero soda, um, which is a melon soda. I really want to try it because I really like melon soda. And the only type that I've tried that I've liked so far is the Fanta melon soda. So hopefully this will be good. And last from Don Quixote, I got these Pom Pom Prin gummies. At first I wasn't gonna get them. I'm like, oh, they're like a kid's candy, like no. And then I saw them again and I caved. I was like, oh, this is so cute. And I just have to try and see if they're good. But yeah, that's it. That's all I got today. All I got, that was kind of a lot. But yeah, I had a lot of fun. I really enjoyed hanging out with Kamon. I hope you guys like seeing Kamon. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye.